Hello everybody and welcome to the SB Game Fun channel and to another episode of Horizon Zero Dawn. If you recall, we had just, on the last episode we had just got that vantage point right over there. And we fought off a corrupted area. Two corrupted areas. Which is just north of uh, Mother's Crown. Took out a couple spots here, then came all the way back um, to Cauldron Sigma, which we did, I believe. I don't, yeah, I don't remember. I don't remember any of this. And then we made our way over here, fought off the corruption here, and now we're gonna. We're on the warpath to Revenge of the Nora. So let's get into the game. All right, here we go. Oh, that looks horrible. I just wanted the skin. I need the skin. I'm scrabbling a bit. I'm scrabbling a little bit. What are you scrabbling about, girl? Sorry folks, my headphone is acting up a little weird. Let me make some adjustments here real quick. Alrighty. Headphones fixed. Now let's take a look. See here. All right. All right, Aloy, let's go do this. here cutscene devil's grief foreboding sight huh don't you ever wonder what it used to look like back when the old ones lived here you're not like other Nora that's what they tell me the old ones War Chief, our scouts found enemy camps in the ruins, guarding the approach to the Ring of Metal. Then we should hit those camps first. Make sure they stay quiet. Agreed. Wipe out the camps, and our enemies in the Ring of Metal won't see us coming. I'll take out the alarms. We'll send braves to each camp to lie in wait. Would you start? They'll help finish. Braves, it is time. Time to fight. Time to kill. Maybe time to die. We will regroup there, at the base of the tallest tower. Then, to the ring of metal and vengeance. Today, we break taboo to honor our dead and punish our enemies. Blood! Spilled for blood spilled. May all mother forgive our trespass, and if not, may she lay her wrath solely upon me. Now, to battle. Oh, look at that! 
ominous, the sun dropping behind the mountains. And there goes the sun. We are now in dusk. So let's do a quick save. What are you waiting for? Take the fight to the enemy. It is as Varl says. We must enter the ruins for the tribe. I know. Yeah, let's take a look see here. So there's this one, this one, and this one. So let's head for the first fireplace. Ugh, going down fast. fireplace so let's head straight towards the fireplace do a quick save and then into the first oh wait a minute wait a minute wait a minute I'm, I'm always rushing into this stuff and not paying attention I do have some skills holy cow I had seven okay how do you it has to be one where I can Quietly. I don't want the extra stuff. Expert carve increased chances of loot skins. This is going to take two. That'll leave me with five. Uh, heavy lifter. I haven't gotten to this yet. Definitely want critical hit. Deals more damage. These two, oh man, I'm gonna suck everything down by going this route. Extra chance for extra sort resources. I can do that later, but I need, I need, I need abilities that will increase my combat effectiveness. And I need some, uh, see, I don't wanna do this just to get the, but I have to. No, I don't. I don't have to. I can wait on that. I'm moving pretty good on that. Um, strike from above. Take down small machines. Humans deal high damage. Well, see, that's combat as well. That's combat. Combat, combat, combat. Oh, what do we do? What do we do? What do we do? What do we do? I got two points to spend. What? Oh, look at this. Three points. Dodge prowess. I suck at dodge, man. I could use that tool skill, but... Oh! Heavy spear attack will knock down machines faster. I would love that. Combat override. Increases the time... Double shot. Oh, double shot. Oh, I need to get this one in, in order to do a double shot? Oh, come on. Really? Disarm, disarm traps. I need the scavenger. And then tinker weapon coils. Oh, I, this whole line here is needed. Ah, so I need this to get this. The double shots. Strong strike. <laughs> strike from above. Oh, look at that. I can strike from below. Dodge prowess. Or go this route because I need this. 
Move faster while wielding a heavy weapon. Gosh, that's that's like how often do I come across? I only I've only come across heavy weapons once so far. I guess the the implication here is that it's going to be coming. Balance aim. Strike from above. Take press to silent drop. That's a good one too. Ah, uh, yeah. It's concentration. Okay, uh, this sounds like a. This is though I don't think I'll use it as often. These must be a, a come with this. So I guess I'm gonna have to add this to the pack. All right, all right. What else? I'm here. Ammo. Do I have anything here? Nope. What do I have here? sorts of stuff oh yes I forgot to mention I did do some resource farming to farm for wires because I was out and I was trying to f find get from creatures at the echo shell um, now I could probably buy it as, as it says here I could buy it from merchants buy it from merchants but I haven't found a merchant yet that that that's oh look at this oh my goodness Take all. Take, oh yes, wire. Yes. Anything I could use? Echo shells, perfect. Nope. Getting wires and a lot of ridge wood. Oh, it's a couple more echo shells. And what do I get here? Oh, so I got these are all the things I've gotten picked up so far. <laughs> okay. And I, it looks like I got something here. Corruption zones. So that's the marker of corruption. And what is this? A charger. Okay, the charger that I ran into that was corrupted the other, the last episode. And a collectible. Oh look, I got all the collectibles for a set one. And then a set two. Actually, there was some dialogue. Ah, text. Here we go. Let's keep reading this. Um, Ma, I can't believe I just stumbled across the place. I remember your injury. Of course, I just forgot that it happened all the way out here. This was before Wyatt, obviously, when things were really hard for us. I was 12 or 13, already smoking dusty every day, and you were working all the time, stuck at the job, and you can, on the job, you convinced Metallurgy to give you after they stiffed us on the death settlement. It must have been terrible, servicing mining robots in dig tunnels for 1.5 basic. But it's how you kept us fed. When the lifter injured you, the foreman said it was your fault. Said the telemetry showed human error, yours. When you told me that the telemetry had been cooked, I didn't believe you. I blamed you for your injury. Same as the company. What a great kid I was. Yeah, what a fool this guy is. Why do I want to read his, his progression? He's a bum. I didn't understand the situation at all. Of course. But this is after the fact. You torture your mom. You put her through all this craziness denial of comp was a financial death blow yeah it can't death denial of employee workers compensation man we were days from living on the street yep which is why you pushed your grievance up the ladder up and up until finally you wound up in Wyatt's office he ordered an investigation which was the right thing to do 
though I had always wondered just how dispassionate his decision was. The investigation proved the telemetry had been tampered with and validated your claim, and the implant and the cybernetics fixed you up and as good as new. But at all appearances, it looked like everything had gotten broken, had been fixed. Hell, another six months and you and Wyatt started seeing each other, so before long, even our poverty was fixed. Well, we didn't know, of course, but we, what, that you'd been poisoned. Lubar 6 exposure from the solvent you used to keep robot joints clear. We were still yet years away from knowing the long-term effects, but the damage was done. You doomed yourself working a crappy job, keeping me fed and clothed, and I can't even remember a single time I thank you for. Screw this place. He still doesn't understand why he's angry. Being angry at the, uh, the company who exposed his mom to poison, or he's just ah, what a what a what a bum rush this guy this kid is. I don't remember anything about the concert, the bands, the music, the crowd. I was too throttled on skydive and snake that might that night to distinguish the thunder of bash core and the roar of blood in my head. And then I ran across the pusher who was selling razor wing for eight bucks a tap. That's right, razor wing, a certain designer stimulant named after a certain late thirties fighter craft that our family had certain unpleasant association with. So I declined the offer, heeded the ominous portent, and got the hell out of there, right? Or maybe what I did was buy four taps and take them all at once. Yeah, did that. According to the police report, I went berserk and attacked the pusher, then set fire to his stash, and then went after the security drones that showed up. I didn't get far, the drones put 50,000 volts through me, which wouldn't have been such a big deal if my heart hadn't already been hammered along at triple time. The shock flat out killed me. The med bots came fast as they could, but the first glitch, glitch out of the second got hung up in the crowd. So I was dead for almost two minutes. And even after that, they revived me. My condition was touch and go on account of all the substance sloshing through my veins. When I came out of the coma, your face was the first thing I saw. You'd been crying. Your makeup was smudged, dark lines down your cheeks. Man, this guy is just such a hard bonehead. When our eyes met, I expected you to start yelling. And weak as I was, I was ready to yell back. Not even a coma could break my defiance. But you didn't yell. You quietly asked why to wait in the hall then pushed your chair right up to the edge of my bed and took my hand. I wanted to jerk the hand away, but I couldn't. Because you're an idiot. It wasn't the strength of your grip that stopped me, but the warmth of your hand, the gentleness by which you took mine. When you spoke, your voice was quiet, just above the whisper. When I lost your Baba seven years ago, you were my only reason to go on living. Your gaze, your gaze lifted to the medical equipment surrounded us. The tubes, the blinking lights, you shook your head. Why do you live like no one loves you? Don't you realize, realize that if you die, all my hopes and dreams, and all the hopes and dreams of your father die with you? You reached and touched my hair, and like a thunder crack, I broke out. Maybe I was just snapping about together, snapping back together. I lay there sobbing for what felt like years. The whole time you never took your hand away, and I didn't either. The next day, I agreed to go into treatment. I wish I could say I never picked up again, but as we both know, that's not exactly how things turned out. Man, this, this guy is a, a real addict or trying to escape something. Ah, who the heck knows? Um, quests. Why do I have quests? Hunting grounds. Maps. Corrupted zones. Uh, tutorials. Oh, I have. Wait, 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 wait. I have tutorials? Card your sharp shot bow, level 18, level. Oh. Hmm. I didn't do any of the tutorials. Maybe that's why I stink. Skills. I got one point. Okay, I don't need that. So. Let's make our way across.
Okay. I'm looking at the cup. I should be looking at the... Oh man, they also have corrupt, corrupted creatures. Oh. What is he doing? What is that? Warning system, some technical, technological construction. Sniffing around. Well, all the Nors are ready. Oh, there actually is a guy. Come on out, buddy. Oh my goodness, he was out looking.
Why are they shooting at me? That guy down there. Oh, why did I switch to that weapon? Oh, my goodness. That looks like we're introduced. Yeah! Uh. Where did they go? We'll go with secret we land. Can't carry more. So we got, okay, we got two more camps to go to before we hit the, the big one. Where would the big one be? Hmm. It's somewhere here, of course. Um, should we, should we get distracted with these? Or should we just go for the quest? I think we should just go for the quest and come back and work on those later. Because I get distracted so easily. And what do I do? Oh, what is this? Hey, I got the ancient vessel called Miriam. Cracked. There's the, the legend Miriam. I'm just going to ignore everything else. Come here. That's a watcher right there. Thank you. 
Oh, it's a destroyed shell walker. Nice. Do a good hunt. Oh my goodness. There are so many of them. Go back to off you go. Nothing there. Of course. Really? Oh, come on. Go around. Did we start off? Ugh. For crying out loud. Killed a Watch their fire. A Nora tribesman. Darn it. 
figure I can... Don't stand in front of me! Will reach us. Always have we are in all the Lord Lord sacred today. land. All mother be praised. That was terrible. The guy is standing up here. The arrow could not reach him. It was just basically. Now, it, 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 if it were just dropping by him, that's one thing. But it was just whizzing over his head or whatever. You, you guys can see it. Now clearly, I, I either my shooting was bad, which probably isn't far-fetched. But it was kind of goofball. Yeah, it was... And of course, guess what? Did I... I mean... If the if, if that combat was just I mean if that alarm system was designed to call more people it would be to me dumb because I wouldn't be calling for more people I would be alerting the main base but what but then again what am I I'm not a game developer I'm just a an average game consumer So what do I know, right? And look like we lost we lost one Nora Brave. Uh, of course that's that's to my my uh, half dingbat incompetence. Yeah, I lost a brave somewhere around here. He died. It was kind of frustrating because I mean I whizzed three arrows across this guy's head and he just kind of standing there going oh. dude one of those arrows had to hit him right Inside this building, it looks like. Gotta be careful. My God, look at it. I'm pretty close to the uh, alarm system. Maybe I could turn that off. Sideways. Dude, 
Dude, the Nora is right here. It's heavy with rain. Oh, come on. Why did you stand up, man? Your head up, buddy. Nope. You hear that? Someone down up here. Oh. Did I hear a splash? Hostile spotted. Here we go. There, she's got the bottom. True if you don't fight. That's a miss. Sweet I victory! Almost. Okay, I did that a little better. I would prefer Enough! I would prefer a more stealthy attack, um, but I'll take it. I'll take it. Get my rocks. No room. Where do I need to go now? Go to the tallest tower. Man, I have to traverse to the tallest. I have to traverse all this open ground or 
It could be full of... Okay, I gotta, I, I gotta take a look and see what it is that I can still make. I need a fish skin. Okay, so that's not gonna happen. I need a raccoon skin, and that can happen. And raccoon skin. Fox skin. Okay, so it looks like three raccoon skin and one fox skin. But I don't need boar skins. And I don't see any... right over there. I see him. Well, I guess that's the tallest building. This'll last. Ah, oh, just great rain. Okay, so these are Nora Braves, it looks like. Holy cow, the rain is sideways. No space. There, it looks like. Okay. I 
didn't want her to do that. Why'd she do that? Goodness, there's a key combination that just gets it right. Every vantage a story. Oh, I thought some I thought they were up here. Let's take a look at the vantage point. A pocket shit storm tour, day six. I was fresh out of rehab when we saw the metallurgists play the hearts wayfarers. The M in Jersey looked pretty funny. Hopefully you're sorry. It's a big giant stadium, it looks like. Raining like it's trying to wash everything away. I thought they were waiting for me up there or something. There they are, standing right over here. Oh, I guess we're going to the stadium. The camps have been dealt with. Now to the Ring of Metal. Its high walls protect the enemy. We'll have to scale the height. Under fire if we're detected. I have another idea. Their base has a weakness. Send me in alone, and I'll exploit it. If I'm successful, I'll blow a hole in those walls big enough for the entire war party to charge through. Sounds like a plan. So long as I get to come with you. A war chief should be grateful for two arrows so eager to spring from the bow. Yes, Varl. Go with Aloy as her spearmate, but be vigilant. Yes, war chief. I will. Go now. We wait on your signal. Hmm. Oh my goodness, there's no I should have I should have hit that fireplace so I can save. Where are you going, Varl? You do have a plan, right? You followed me this far, even into the room. I thought you trusted me. I do, but how would you know that this base has a weakness? Patience, Varl. You'll know soon enough. There was something I saw over here, yes. Idiot army. I'm not sure what I expected, being part of a hacker collective to be like exactly, 
But so far, the whole idiot army thing has been anticlimactic. Turns out being a world-renowned cyber threat most, mostly consists of hanging out in, a, in intentionally tacky-looking hollow spaces with dudes in anonymizing skins, most of which are like meme base. Like there's a dude or maybe a few dudes with a skin modeled after that incredible, incredulous pigeon reaction hollow couple guys who were literally just walking kapok trees. I asked someone what the next big operation would be. I even had suggestions. Doxing Far Zenith? Fitzing corporate war bots? Come on. And he called me a turd baron, as though data re corrupted. Oh, there, there was a fireplace somewhere near here. Let me, I want to get it. I don't, anything. Okay, Varl, sorry. You're supposed to go somewhere? go oh that is that is high take my hand Jeez. Clearly I wasn't following him. There. That scene. See that covered shelter? Do you see those corruptors? 
Focus, Thoral. That shelter is full of blaze. A whole stockpile of it. If I set it off, the explosion will destroy those corruptors and collapse the wall, too. A breach for the Nora to charge through. Can't hit it from here, though. We'll need to get closer. I'll get closer. You head back, tell Sona the plan, and lead them to that side of the ring. I'll see it done. And when the wall collapses, I'll be first through the breach. Now all I have to do is make it all happen. Holy cow. If I can do this quietly, it'll be a lot easier. Goodness, really? Creature walks in a circular route around that pool. This guy walks up and down this platform. I want to take him out. Okay, here we go. Well, we get an angle on that place and shoot it. Oh my god, there is so many of them there. Holy cow, okay. Where are they gonna put me? That, I, I attracted way too many of them. If I can do this quietly, it'll be a lot easier.
him go up, go down, take that guy out. Gonna be climbing on that stuff. Whoa, the dude just walked right by me. See we can thin out the herd maybe a little. Oh my goodness. Haven't you got anything better to do? A corpse! Oh, I didn't even know there was a guy in there. See if I can attract a couple of them over here. Could be something here. Are you hearing things?
Looks like I'm clear. What was that? About to get oh, I've spotted. I need to get to that place fast. I will teach you to bleed. There we go. Goodness. Oh, well, this is gonna take me longer than I thought. Back to the fight. the heck Kill him! Kill him! Only one way out of this. Oh, missed again. All mother, look upon our victory. A debt of blood is paid. Remember this day, brave Nora. From your lips to the goddess's ears. Yes, remember it. Woo! Be ready to leave this place. Let your spears and arrows rest in the bodies of the fallen. They are tainted, like these ruins. It's over. For the they sacred land. Kill again. I need to find Olin. 
and learn everything he knows. Who the killers were, how they saw me through his focus. I'd have to leave something else behind. Okay. That big bellow back that I blew up. He's right up there somewhere. You're a skilled warrior, Aloy. Rost trained you well. Did you know him? A long time ago. Well enough to know he was a good man. Then why was he cast out? What crime did he commit? I wish I could tell you. But it seems only the High Matriarchs know that story. So I've heard. Well, I should be on my way. Thank you, Aloy. May all mother bless your journeys, wherever they take you. You won't be coming back with us, will you? I don't think so. I'm glad you accomplished what you were looking for, Varl, but I haven't. Not yet. Look, I know you have to go. You're a seeker, after all. But if you ever pass this way again... Then what? It'd be good to see you, that's all. I expect we'll regroup at Mother's Crown. Maybe I'll see you there? Maybe you will. I'll see you then. Yes, we will see you then, Varl. Ah, this is... A brutal... End... Um... To a massacre. Oh my goodness, where is this taking, this next path taking me? What is this? To Day Tower. Okay. I am done with all of these. Devil's Grief. So what I need to do is let me side quests. Let's, un let's uncheck that.
Alrighty, so um, I am over my li time limit right now. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to move to the closest um, campfire. Save. And I am going to call it right there ladies and gentlemen thank you for joining me today on horizon zero dawn episode uh, i don't know I don't, i've forgotten what episode this is but i uh, appreciate you hanging out to the end um if you like my kind of uh gameplay this goofy spastic uh gameplay don't forget to subscribe and click on that bell to get notified and i hope to see you on the next episode until then have a good one